Node and containers really work exceptionally well together. Node as a development language allows your team to build applications very, very quickly. But then how do you do that when you want to roll that out to production? Containers allow you to take those applications you've built and roll them out to production in a scalable, repeatable fashion. And if you're a small, mid-sized business or a startup, you're not going to have the, the funds to pay for a large operations team. And so pairing Node and containers together allows you to build and iterate incredibly quickly. And I think enterprise companies are also recognizing that they can leverage these open source tools like Node and containers, and they also can use that so they can pair their extensive operations team with these same tools that allows them to also accelerate their iter iterative development process. Enterprises can adopt or would want to adopt microservices if they want to quickly iterate a specific function, feature, or maybe even a business unit. So for example, a business that wants to roll out a new mobile application, they might build microservices to support that mobile application and that mobile application only. So the team that's building that mobile app and the backing services, they can build quickly, they can iterate quickly without needing to rework or rewrite or impact the rest of their infrastructure. And then when it's time when they roll out that mobile app, those microservices sort of become part of their existing infrastructure. And if you do that over and over and over again, you eventually realize that you have an entire microservice architecture. We've seen Node be incredibly successful because there's so many people that know JavaScript. If you look at a business, they oftentimes have extensive resources that are familiar with JavaScript. They might be front-end developers. And with Node, those businesses can leverage that expertise. So even if you don't know Node, but you know JavaScript, it's pretty easy to get started and get up and running with Node.